start to finish. Nothing would kill all of these technologies better than a door nail faster than to bring them into committee within the typical structure that we have for uh, aeronautical development. I, I, I can't tell you how many times I've sat down with PhDs, in some cases PhDs who taught me some of this stuff, and had them talk the entire program out of existence in the span of 15 minutes. So it, it, it is, just has to be done. It has to be done right. So the fear is that our production tool has been the finished aircraft success, the production tool is necessary, the money that's necessary will necessitate the tooling that other people can screw up. Uh, well, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm following the, uh, the argument there. Well, uh, production tooling doesn't exist. This is being built with the one-off. If we were funded according to the original plan, we'd be building production tooling. But this is a one-off. Uh, and I'm exploring ways that are uh, not tooling dependent. So there's a, there's a lot of stuff that looks complicated that isn't. And uh, I want to speak to that integration of design thing for just a second, because if you take uh, you know, if you take a month to say, make something in SOLIDWORKS, combine the attributes of 17 parts, you save huge amounts of assembly and complexity down the road. I mean, you didn't need that jig, you didn't need this part, you didn't need that weight, you didn't need this liability. It's all built in. And so uh, the way that the kit is envisioned is that everything that has a complex geometrical shape is built in a factory. And if it's built in a factory, it's got all the stuff in it. So my wing tip right here might have, uh, you know, it's got a complex geometrical shape, so it'll show up to the home builder as a finished product. But it's going to have the fuel, uh, the fuel cap door fully integrated. Okay, it's going to have the chase for the wiring. It's going to have the wiring and the lighting and the, and the antenna stuff built into it. So everything that's downstream complexity is built into the complex part. I didn't hear that. Integral versus bladder tank fuel cell. Integral versus bladder tank or fuel cell. Uh, integral is fine for this type of construction. It shouldn't be any problem at all. We have a capacity for a ridiculous amount of gas. If you're flying with uh, Gen A and uh, the Delta Hawk diesel in Synergy, you have a transcontinental, trans Pacific airline. You can go anywhere you want to go. Uh, controls. Uh, one of the things I think is pretty cool about the cockpit design is uh, it's a little bit kid, kid in a candy store for me because I always wanted to be the, the guy in the F-16 on the pointy end of the airplane, right? So the cockpit experience up front is you're solo, you're surrounded by all the stuff you want. It's uh, not in your way, you've got a beautiful, unobstructed view. But right behind you is a standard side-by-side -side dual arrangement. So you can fly it solo, you can fly it tandem dual, you can fly it side-by-side -side dual, or you can be an instructor with two students. Or you can fly side-by-side -side sitting with your wife and you can put uh, your VIP 12-year-old in the front seat. How about that? What do you ingest the cooling air? Where do I ingest the cooling air? Uh, under the wing inlets. I'm sorry, under the wing, uh, under the wing rip fillet. We kind of mock that up. It's not, that's not how it actually will be. In fact, they're a little, they're way too big. But uh, I wanted something on there that was representative of uh, actual condition, and that's kind of what best we could do. Are you all wet, wet layups? Am I all wet layup? Uh, we're using uh, mostly wet layup, but I've got some infusion parts uh, for vacuum assisted resin transfer. I'm not using any pre breaks or any high temperature processes at this time. Thank you all for your questions. It's been a real pleasure. We're going to take this party to the Aero Innovate thing, which is in the Innovation Center. Uh, that's where we're going to be uh, hanging out for most of the day today. And then we'll be around there from time to time if you have any questions. Thank you very much.